on show, I, on show I have um, a couple of uh, photographs in the video and um, in this show I've been, I've, I worked more with pieces uh, with strong imagery let's say, uh, with photographs, um, very visual, um, related then to text which is the closest I, I have to a medium in a certain sense both as a as a beginning, a kickstart for for the process of work, and uh, as an end point, um, so text becomes most of the times like the end product, or um, in the shape of uh, wall texts, books, uh, uh, essays, even that that then are discussed in group meetings also. Um, this is um, this. This is very important to me because I see my production as hopefully like um, a, a catalyzer for, for, for broader discussions. Um, so the elements that I bring into, into the works, which are usually quite um, from distinct times or distinct cultures, um, producing either a clash or a relation between them, um, I see this as, as entrance points to critical uh, um, questions and, and inquiries on on issues I'm I'm concerned about as an artist. So um, this can be th this usually have a, a, a strong temporal quality and a, a, a mostly also a, a quality of, of otherness and alterity, like. How do you become um, another and these processes of of hybridization through time and through culture? Well, the work I developed for my first show here in Umberto Marino that came after uh, a nice relationship developed from a group show created by Lorenzo Bruni last year is called Barbarian Politics. And the central piece of the show is a text. I've been writing the past couple of months around the age of balance. They are, in a way, a very in disguise version of a theoretical text. The idea came from Lucretius, uh, the Roman poets, to, in a way, embellish something that is rather violent. It's like uh, thinking of the work of art as a trap. And in a way, the text is just something that opens a relationship to the other side that are being projected in the room, uh, almost like a, a set for a group session of things, like a think tank, in a way, that the work itself is very open and things can be rewritten like, almost like a synapses in the brain, making relations between all a lot of things that I quoted and referring there being like historical moments or literary moments or even specific works of art that I quoted. And in a way this is my way of trying to think, like, not just my way, but of, of all, all of us thinking together with this sense of proposing what could be the pertinence of this history of violence, linguistic violence, systemic violence, subjective violence. In a way, it's a very open work, and uh, I think the format wrote the text in being rather similar to a symbolist poem gives it an extra layer of referentiality that could be 